It's the mother of all elections. India's megapole is the biggest in the world. It takes nearly six weeks to complete and logistically it's complicated. 900 million citizens eligible to vote, more than a million electronic voting machines, 543 constituencies, thousands of political parties and candidates, and of course, film stars, and a bit of song and dance. Prime Minister Narendra Modi has been boosted by the recent bust-up with Pakistan and remains popular. But the right-wing Hindu nationalist is vulnerable on the economy. Critics say economic growth has been too slow to give opportunities to the million Indians entering the labour market each month. Modi and his BJP party are accused of favouring Hindus at the expense of India's sizeable minorities. The 68-year-old is up against not one, but two Gandhis. Congress party's Rahul Gandhi is hoping to become the latest Prime Minister from his dynasty. He's worked hard to shed his image as a political lightweight. His sister Priyanka Gandhi Vadra has also joined the fray. Her fans say she is reminiscent of her grandmother and former Premier Indra Gandhi. Priyanka has been tasked with reviving Congress in Uttar Pradesh, a Hindu heartland for Modi. The Premier won by a landslide in 2014, but this year's poll looks like being a far closer race. We'll find out the winner when votes are counted on May 23rd.